She's been chasing deer. She's been chasing bunnies. She's not been doing her job. The first antler we find, I find it by sight, not by her nose. She's about to get fired. So we might be doing a giveaway at the end of this one. If uh, anyone's interested in a free black lab. This is Gracie, and you're probably wondering how I trained her to find moose antlers, like the one she's trying to pull out of the water right now. We'll get to that, but first we need to go back to the beginning. Well, she found it. I call her American Shed Dog because she's an American lab, and she's a shed dog. We first met up in 2013. I wasn't looking for a dog, it was just one of those things that was meant to be. We needed a task and purpose for working together, and shed hunting seemed to suit us well. So we began training together. Very silly. Good girl. I gave her a broken piece of a moose paddle I had found in the fall where two bulls had been fighting. She loved it. We played hide and seek with it all around the house. I'd hide it under different furniture, the bed, the couch, the coffee table, I'd even hide it in the cupboards. And every time she found it, I gave her a reward and lots of praise. Good girl, good girl, get them on. <laughs> the rest was on the job training. That's it, it was that simple. Just a lot of time spent working together in the woods. There's no substitute for that. For a while we worked for the army at Norwich University, training cadets mostly in infantry tactics and military mountaineering. We're main guides now and we do wilderness trips like this one. There's really only been one time that I went shed hunting without her. That was because she had an injured paw and had to stay home. But this happened. He was a young bull, and I think he had just gotten the boot, so he was just looking for someone to hang out with. He followed me around for a while, and he even let me scratch his ears. But I didn't find any sheds that day. Come on! Come on, Gracie! Gracie, come! Come. I didn't realize at the beginning that this sort of thing would be a theme for our adventures. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> Crazy! <laughs> Not today, Gracie! Good girl! Good girl! <laughs> Good girl, Gracie! But look at us now. It's deeper than 
I expected it to be. Gracie's going downstream. So, <clears throat> can't believe it. We found a shed. It's in the river. I'm honestly not even sure if it's a moose or a deer. It's gotta be a moose. It's a crazy looking one. I'm not sure if it's showing up on camera or not. We are going to recover this thing. All right, Gracie's gonna be super pumped. She doesn't even know. She doesn't see it yet. She doesn't know what we're doing. All right. Gracie, we're shed. <laughs> We're shed on you. Oh. It's a it's a moose antler. That's pretty cool. Gracie, I got you a boat. I got a boat in the river. All right. <laughs> That's shed hunting right there. Alright, we got one today so far. Nice brown one. Yes, Gracie, good girl. Uh, I saw it before her, but she still gets rewarded. Good girl, good girl. So, let me figure out how to snap the camera here. Good girl. Right at the base of a rub. We've been looking really hard in here, so pretty fantastic to find one <coughs> right now. I came back to an area that uh, we've been to um, earlier and uh, it was just bugging me girl, because uh, we found a few in here and no matches so we had to come back and look for the match. The thing about this, this is not a match to any of the ones that we found so you know either there's a bunch of one antlered moose in here or uh, <laughs> we're just struggling trying to find these ma matches. I, I don't know. Gracie, she's been chasing deer. She's been chasing bunnies. She's not been doing her job. The first antler we find, I find it by sight, not by her nose. She's about to get fired. So we might be doing a giveaway at the end of this one. If uh, anyone's interested in a free black lab don't sass me yeah she knows i'm glad we got this brown one this one is in just perfect condition and uh so we're thankful for that just a uh four pointer i guess that's cool <clears throat> we're gonna keep looking really pumped it's a little brownie fork Gracie walked right by it. <clears throat> Gracie, what's that right there? There's a bone. This is this is embarrassing. Gracie, we're just playing Gracie, aren't we? Uh, what is that? That's a bone. So cool. Kind of has some mule deer traits going on. I don't know. It's a little funky, but uh, this is awesome. This is where Gracie found her first antler in 2013. Uh, it's changed a lot, so a little disappointed in that. But uh, it was cool. We uh, kind of climbed a mountain, got an awesome view. I just saw, shot some footage of the view from the mountain. And uh, yeah, we were just coming back down. And uh, we just happen to be uh, in the right path. So uh, I'm thrilled about it. You know us, we get pumped about all this stuff. Except Gracie, you know, she walked right by this and then when I let her onto it, she stepped over it. So I don't know, shed machine's broken. Maybe she just needs to tune up. I don't know. 
maybe I don't know it's unacceptable really <clears throat> She's still my best friend and the best $200 I ever spent.